like the phone end adapter. All of our cameras are wonky. This is just, this is just, hello. Hi everybody. Okay, that's the wrong adapter. What does it say? Like, what is the, what is a phone adapter? A phone adapter is like rectangular, flat and rectangular, like my hand, and you're trying to put in an adapter like this. This, not this. That's not gonna get you for your phone. Well, here we are. Oh my goodness. There must it's, be a reason we do this in the morning. Because we are totally missing. <sighs> Toast, tired. Wait till I tell you what I titled Hi, it. Hi, Jerry. I can't even. I don't even want to know what you titled it. I'm taking my microphone off. Well, we don't have to tell Melissa what I titled my video, but why don't you all guess? Guess, Melissa or Amy, who's going to win this? Competition is pretty low for you. So, um, all right, I've got my winner, too. I don't have a winner. Well, you better figure it out because we're going. I, can, I don't Moving know if I can, Say hey when you're hopping on. I can't game. talk hey, and Kyra. do that all at the same time. Yeah, you can totally figure it Kyra's out. Kyra's there. Um, um, if you missed it, uh, re read my video description, my video title. Don't tell Melissa what it is and cast your vote. Who's going to win, Melissa or Amy? You're so bad. I think that's kind of Taking funny. advantage of me like the old lady no. trying, to, trying to be alert at 8. 34 and I know I, we are really this tired. is like so much longer hold on how's it going over there are you doing well I'm trying to find it okay you find it but don't take too do long you have to a find prop? it do you have a prop I, I have a prop oh my gosh <laughs> so I thought you had a beer it does sound like I opened one nope just a sparkling water hello everyone hi mama and Mimi on a Monday late at night yeah. Late at night because mom and Mimi in the evening is not nearly as catchy. Oh, sorry. Oh, you're just knocking your sorry. table. Um, it's easiest if you go to your videos. So, um, well, while you work on that, do you have anything? I just was thinking. We were out, um, Bad Bob and I were out on our bikes tonight, and we ran into the Bommets family. And Literally. you have not lived until you have seen Zella Bommets ride her globber. And for those of you who don't know what a globber is, it's like a... It's a scooter. It, like, it's a scooter. It's in the scooter shape right now. So, um, look at look at our colors. This, we are just oh, you got a vote that you think you're going to win. Okay. Okay. So, anyway, Zella did really good. She goes a million miles per hour. She keeps up. We're all on bicycles. And she's just... Anyway, she did a major digger. She took a major fall off of that globber. Not so much here or here, but right here. And, um, and just was like almost barely able to breathe because it hurt her so much. And she's so tired. She's tired. And we, I was thinking about how we reacted as a family. We all just kind of were like, oh, great job. You're doing, you're fine. And if anybody had been watching us. Well, that's what happened when we were in Minnesota this weekend. Zella went running into a room and caught the leg of a metal chair and went flying across the room. And there was there was easily a hundred people in the room. A good majority of them saw it. And I started going, "Don't make eye contact. Don't make eye contact." <laughs> and I was like, "Everybody, just keep going, keep going." And she got up and she kept moving along. So. Yeah. So I was just thinking about that, and I was thinking about childhood memories of like falling. And didn't Whitney? We. It, um, we used to call blowing your breath out, but didn't she knock her wind out? Or what do you call that, like technically? What do you call it? That's a good question for you guys. Um, it's either, I'd say it's either knocking, I mostly hear knock your wind out. Well, we knock always call out it out blowing even. your wind out because our kids did it about or every blow three your breath days. Out. Yeah, that too. But then there's that horrible thing where you can't breathe and you're trying to breathe in and you can't. And we finally figured out, as our kids were like all getting married, that you have to blow out. You have to do... We in the middle it, of it. We put it to the test yesterday and it was quite effective. And it works. Very yeah. immediately effective. Yeah, so that took me down the rabbit trail of uh, childhood memories and then ice cream trucks. Do you remember ice cream trucks? I had my quarters on my, my like you wore the necklace with the quarters right I here. I don't know what she's doing. You wore the quarters and it would pop off and you can get your quarters out and you could go. Is that I come out of George Washington and it, 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 the music would be oh, playing. That's awesome. Well, I, okay, so there's certain songs. Like as in the top ten ice cream truck songs. I got a vote that I was gonna win. Oh, get wow. the wind knocked out of you. Yeah, yeah, there the you go. Out so out you gotta you. watch the. You have to watch the video of the news reporter, um, stomping grapes. grapes. What? <laughs> if she had known to blow her breath out, she would not have gone viral. Yeah, she she really did. So here, here, tell me if these don't like take you down memory lane. Okay. I think I want to win too. Now I have I have it on sped up. I'm sped up here. 
Okay, so that's, oh. that's number 10. <laughs> it's a very fast ice cream truck. All right, now let's listen to nine. Does nothing for me. You Not nostalgic that? at all. Okay, don't remember that. Okay, how about this one? Yes. You remember that one? I don't remember that one from Park Ridge, Illinois, I gotta tell you. No. Nope. Lullaby? No, I think they've gone, I think there's like really probably one or two ice cream truck song, songs. Okay. I think 10 is a stretch. One of these is um, there's... Little Brown Jug. I have no clue what this. No, don't know. It sounds like Mario when it's on Okay, this is the one that played in Downers Grove, Illinois, that Bad Bob loved. Are you ready? Oh, oh, wait for it. Where'd it go? You're being very patient. <laughs> Why isn't it playing? You have to hit play. There's an ice cream truck around here. We've spotted it twice already this year. You have? Yeah, and I, I... Okay, sailing, sailing? Well, no, no, no. Mm -hmm. We haven't gotten the one that was mine. Red Wing. Red Wing. You say that like I know what room. Everybody in the comments was talking about Red Wing. Hmm. Okay, number two. Don't know, this is the one. This is the... Did you... It's a fun version. All right, here it is. All right, it's like coming Last but not least. Yeah, Turkey me either. It's called Turkey yeah, I wouldn't have known any of the entertainer would have known that. Well, it took me down this horrible rabbit trail with Bad Bob tonight, and he was, we were laughing we're about the rapper. The trail. Yeah, the, the rapper. Um, here, I had to write his name down. Caswell. Ice cream truck song. Don't watch it with kids around. Um, anyway, rappers. Wow, it sounds like you guys had a really fun rabbit <laughs> trail. Well, I'm the mama. <laughs> and I'm the Mimi. And this is Mama and Mimi on a Monday. So we come to you whenever we want and whenever it works for our schedule. And we like to bring, um, I don't know, fun, hilarity, sometimes some tips on health and wellness. And why is we don't Kyra agree on what we calling bring to you. me a horsey mama? I don't know. What did you write about me? I don't know. That's funny. You wrote something about me. I don't me. know. Um, so we don't always agree on what we're coming to you with, but here we are. We do a giveaway, though. So make sure you say, hey, if you're watching live or something like Horsey Mama, and you can pop a comment. <laughs> what did you do? <laughs> Hashtag ice cream chuck if you're catching the replay. Um, my giveaway winner from last month is when we cleaned Catherine's toilet, Diana Koch. Winner, oh. winner, chicken dinner, and for you? Oh, I don't know. I'm still you trying to pick find one. it. You can post it later. I'm going to post that. it later. Oh, wait. It might be right here. Mm -mm. There it is, isn't it? Just post it later. She's oh. going to post later. I've, I've told I've, her what I've to do. I've been told. We're going to post later. What? What is Kyra writing about? I don't know. Okay. I have to think about what she's getting at. I'm really <laughs> missing it. Kyra, up over here. It's going like this. <laughs> Um, okay, what, why are we here tonight? We, oh, eyebrows, obviously. So we are doing a series of events here on Thursday nights at Superior Street Wellness. It's called um, Summer Nights, and we are having different speakers come in on different topics. Mini community classes. Yes, and we had Lizeth from Simply Pretty Spa come and speak two weeks ago. And she selected Wax somebody's eyebrows out of the audience on the spot. It was awesome. So much so that we're doing it again. Yeah, we do have to do it again. We're going to do it again in July. In fact, July 7th, after the one where we're making cocktails. Cocktails, cocktails to eyebrow waxing. Do you know that one time one of um, my oil client's husbands just referred to me as eyebrows? Mm -hmm. Really? Yes. That's Back when my like, man fixed them in the day. She, Mary much. says it's past your bedtime. May, um, fix them. Fix them back in the day. Mandy did. Oh, Mandy. So, comment, tell us in the comments, have you ever had your eyebrows waxed? I mean, I feel like it's okay to I ask think it's that. Like yes a, or no? Well, it's like crazy. People are either like, oh my gosh, no one touches my eyebrows. <laughs> or people say, I'm happy to have somebody do it. Or they do their own and half of them are missing. Well, that sometimes happens. Sometimes it doesn't. Have you seen that? I've seen that. That's terrifying. No, I haven't. Somebody we know well had that happen. Um, this Thursday is e-bikes. My mom has talked somebody into bringing e-bikes to Superior Street Wellness for us to ride. Half eyebrows. Are we doing an insurance waiver? Not at all. <laughs> um, no insurance waivers. What? I started waxing my own when COVID started. Oh, bold. You're brave. Bold, Mary. 
Um, very bold choice. I like it. I haven't noticed, so you're good. I mean, maybe I should. No, I don't know. I want to know. Do you do your own eyebrows? You haven't made fun of my there? eyebrows. <laughs> um, and then what are we doing? Flash freezing. Freeze flashing. Freeze, Freeze drying. drying. Freeze know, drying. How to, how to provide like food for into the future. Well, oh. Just shift your body a little bit. But then I'm over right over oh, this. <laughs> we shouldn't do this at night. <clears throat> um, and then it's juicing. Yep, we're doing juicing. June is fun for cocktails. sure. Cocktails. We have some really fun things happening. So what time are those on Thursday nights? So the goal is come into town at 4 30 in the Listen afternoon. Listen very closely. Come in at 4 30 in the afternoon, get a beverage from either Fika or Deja Brew. Bring your Whoa. beverage in here. Okay, and then we're gonna do some hand massage as we're waiting. And then our speakers start at 5 p.m. sharp. Yep, and everyone's on their way easily by six. Easily. Yeah, easily. because you've got a summer night to go enjoy. Yeah. Um, Kyra has hers waxed. Okay. And Jordan has hers waxed. Okay, good, good guys. Um, what else are we doing here this summer? I know. Well, <laughs> we have like the best make and take set up for you that are gonna make your do. life so easy. Well, we have. For Aoi example, spray. I just used Aoi spray all over Zella. That was why I was talking about Zella. Aoi and we spray. need extra. For sure, we're going to be needing extra on that at mm -hmm. our house. So, Aoi Spray, we're helping you mix up, which you can use for so many things. Mm -hmm. all, like, all kinds of skin irritations, mm -hmm. not just flying off a scooter. Yeah. We stick. have the, the, favorite, the favorite summer ones. It's stick and bug bites. Or bug off. Bug, bug off. off. It's tired. It's late. I'm bug tired. off. Um, you made a really fun summer foot soak. I did. A foot soak and a hand scrub. Mm -hmm. And a seasoning salt. A seasoning salt and a veggie spray. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Mr. Veggies and um, cook them on the grill or in yeah, the oven. Yeah, that's good. You're helping me think about it. Are you coming back? I'm coming. Hello. I got her. I got her back. Um, so those things are all coming down the pipeline. Mm -hmm. um, we are including some of those make and takes in them. Like, you can make them while you're here for the um, mini community class, those summer nights. You can also set up a time to just come in and make some. Mm -hmm. We've got that tomorrow morning. Somebody's coming in. Yeah, Jolie says, hey, stop by, eh? So funny. Um, yeah, you can come in anytime, but it's best if you let one of us know you're coming, and we will. Yeah, because I was here today and I locked both doors, so don't don't come. Didn't want to see anybody. Uh huh. <laughs> I cry if I plug them myself. I missed oh, who that was. Yeah, me too. There's great hilarity here. Um, I mean that's that's what I know. What kind of ice cream? Bob and I were trying to remember what kind of ice cream we would get from the truck. Oh, I liked the ones with the face, like the little, like the yellow guy with the face, which is terrifying. Or the push pop I used to get. I know, really upsetting. Oh, I like those rocket pops. Ooh, or the one with the strawberry coating, like, like the white strawberry. Oh, and they had like the little bumps, the crunchies yeah. on the outside. Bob yeah. loved a drumstick. Mm -hmm. Joel, what did you have? I want to know that what kind of ice cream, cream treats you got. Treat. Eyebrow waxing, ice cream treats. We've had all the essentials. All the important things in life. Mm -hmm. What are you drinking? I just got sparkling water. Do you want to know what I asked him? And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm, we are going to bed immediately. Okay. Um, I asked them who they thought would yawn first, you or me. And neither of us did! Because I, I yawned all the way here because I wondered what we were doing this so late for. Oh, see, Sponge, Sponge loved to push pop. She's right, SpongeBob with the gumball eyes. Yeah, I like, ha I, thank you, Jordan. Thank you. Jordan's always. Paper so tube and all. I know, like, <laughs> that was the worst. And then it would like melt down and it would fail. The push up part would oh, fail. Yeah. Oh, I do remember. Yeah, that. it was. Somebody a mess. would always cry. Choco Taco. What's what is that? that? Abby, tell us about that. Yeah, I'm going to have to look that up. Did she? She oh. had the La Cucaracha playing on hers if she was having a Choco Taco. I've actually seen the ice cream truck three times. We found it at the BMX track. So if you're oh, looking you for it. You BMX track? Yeah, I'm with Gary's new friend. Oh, that's right. So you yeah. did. Um, and the ice cream truck was there, and there was there were like 400 people at the ice cream truck. So if you ever, um, BMX is on Monday nights. There's another night too. How much do ice cream trucks cost now? Um, like how many quarters? I thought you had to do like a dollar fifty. Oh, I don't know. Oh, really? I thought you had six quarters in your little. Whitney holder. and Zella both got a treat for maybe six dollars, six something, at one day. Hmm. Did you see anybody roller skating around there? Mm -mm. I didn't see uh, John Travolta. Stop. Okay, this is where we <laughs> sign her up. So pay attention to those um, summer nights. They really have been fun. Yeah, we're, we're excited. Done a great job. We played kickball last week and it was so fun. And now Bad Bob has 15 kickballs. So we're going to do a big kickball game with as many people as we can gather. Like, yeah, we'll let the adults come to this time. We're going to need a bigger playing We're going to do like a Guinness Book of World Records. Oh, a drumstick cone, but in a taco. 
I can't visualize it. We've got to go Google Abby, that. will you make some for us? That's right. I don't know that they can be made for taco. If she used a corn tortilla, I'd be all over that. Well, I think it's like something. Maybe so you caught her. She was going to hang up on all of us, and now she's back. You intrigued her. Choco taco. Oh, it's a thing. There's a meme. There's a meme. Oh. <laughs> Choco taco. No! Who came up with that? There's a keychain on Etsy for 20 bucks. I'm getting you one, Abby. <laughs> you can get a fridge magnet. It's like a legitimate thing. Does we should the same do that company for, make um, it? Tasha Saran. 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 I'm done. Smith. I'm done. That was amazing. Okay, good. We've got some kickball takers. Okay. Melissa's got to go to bed. I got to drive her I home didn't and go to bed. I won. Okay. We'll see you guys some see other you. time. Bye.